Unboxing and setting up the HP Smart Tank 670, 720, 750, 790, 6000, 7000, 7300, 7600 printer series. Remove the printer from the box. Open the box and then remove the setup guide. Remove the printer from the box and place it on a level surface where you intend to use it. Remove the box containing the ink bottles and power cord. Remove any foam caps in the bag surrounding the printer. Remove any tape from the outside of the printer. Remove the foam liner from the scanner. Lower the scanner lid. Now lift the ink access door and the scanner lid together by lifting the ink access door handle on the left side of the printer. Remove any internal cardboard or tape from the printhead and ink tank area. Open the paper tray and remove the cardboard from this area. Then close the paper tray. The setup guide has the QR code for downloading HP Smart App to your mobile device or computer and information to contact HP support. Connect the power cord to the rear of the printer and then plug the other end of the power cord into an electrical outlet. Caution, do not connect the USB cable at this time. The connection to the computer is established during software installation. Turn on the printer. Caution, after turning on the printer, do not press the Wi-Fi button on the printer or the printer will no longer be in Wi-Fi setup mode and HP Smart will not be able to locate your printer. If you accidentally press the Wi-Fi button, use the factory reset steps to return to Wi-Fi setup mode. If you have a printer with a touchscreen control panel, follow the on-screen prompts to select your language and, if applicable, select your country or region. Install the printer software. You can now install the HP Smart Printing app. This app will connect your printer to your mobile device or computer. On a computer or mobile device, visit 123.hp.com to download the HP Smart app or HP Easy Start software for Windows 7 users. The HP Smart app is required to print with your printer. Open the app and follow the step-by-step -step instructions to connect the printer to a wireless network and create an HP account. Fill the ink tanks. Be aware of the following when working with ink bottles. Keep the ink bottles beyond the reach of children. Open the ink bottle only when you are filling the ink tanks. Store the ink bottles upright in a cool, dry place. Lift the ink access door and then open the tank covers. Open the cap on the black ink tank. If your ink bottles have twist-off lids, twist to remove the lid and then set it aside. If your bottles have a flip-top lid, twist the lid to remove it. Pull the seal tab to completely remove it from the bottle and then dispose of the seal. Replace and tighten the lid on the bottle and then flip open the lid. Match the black ink bottle with the black ink tank. Hold the bottle on the tank nozzle, making sure the tip of the bottle fits properly over the nozzle, and let the ink drain into the tank until the tank is full. Note, if the bottle does not start draining, remove it and then reinsert it into the tank. Do not squeeze the bottle. After the black ink tank is filled, set the bottle upright and then close the ink bottle lid. Close the black ink tank cap. Repeat the previous steps to fill the other ink tanks. Once the ink tanks have been filled, close the tank covers and then the ink access door. Wait 30 seconds for the printer to calibrate before moving forward with the next step. Store bottles with leftover ink upright in a cool, dry place. Install the printheads. Lift the ink access door and then wait for the carriage to move to the center and stop. Press the blue button to open the printhead cover. Remove and discard the orange guard. Note, handle the orange guard carefully to avoid ink stains. Remove the printheads from their packaging. Remove the orange cap and protective tape from both printheads. Caution, do not touch the copper colored contacts or the ink nozzle. Do not replace the protective tape on the contacts. 
Handling these parts can result in clogs, printhead failure, and bad electrical connections. Insert the black and tricolor printheads into their associated slots. Close the printhead cover. Close the ink access door. Load paper. Open the input tray. Press and hold the button on one of the paper width guides. Slide the guides to the edge of the input tray. Load a stack of plain paper with the print side facing down into the input tray. Make sure the stack of paper is aligned with the appropriate paper size lines and does not exceed the stack height marking on the tray. Adjust the paper width guides until they touch the edges of the stack of paper. Close the input tray. Pull out the output tray extender. To complete the printer setup, align the printhead and scanner. This is a critical step to ensure full printer functionality. Align the printheads and the scanner. If your printer has a touchscreen control panel, follow the control panel prompts to print an alignment page, and then follow the instructions on the page to scan it and align the new printheads. If your printer does not have a touchscreen control panel, an A blinks on the control panel and an alignment page prints automatically. Follow the instructions on the page to scan it and align the new printheads. You are now ready to start printing. Click the Playlists tab in YouTube to find HP videos in other languages, and search our channel to find official HP support videos.